Stacy Dash. Oh, God. <laughs> she's currently trending right now. Give you a little bit of history. Stacy Dash was kind of a trailblazer for the grift. Mm -hmm. She really was. Mm -hmm. She was grifting the, the uh, Mitt Romney years. She came out in support of Mitt Romney over President Barack Obama, even though she voted for President Barack Obama in 2008. And because she came out in support of Mitt Romney, they threw her on Fox News. A few years later, she was fired. And then she came out last year and did some teary-eyed video saying that she was playing the role, I'm paraphrasing here, of the black conservative, the angry black woman, whatever she said. Oh, and during her grifting years, she called uh, uh, um, Jesse Williams a plantation slave. She attacked BET for segregation, even though she got many of her checks from BET. <laughs> uh, and she said that the reason why there's a high divorce rate is because women don't know how to take care of their men. I believe at that point she had been divorced three times. Why am I uh, so she was, uh, she, she was putting all the talking points out there. And she was recently on BET's uh, Celebrity College Hill, yeah. and she left. Uh, you know, she, she wasn't as uh, skillful as an Omarosa, but now uh, she had a moment on social media looking very, very light, might I, might I add, very Sammy, Sammy Sosa-ish, because she just found out almost a year and a half later that the icon DMX has passed away. Listen to this. Okay, y'all. I'm ashamed. I... First of all, why the Mary J. Bly song in the background? <laughs> Son, did you add that? Because I don't remember that being... Or did she what, was, do that? I don't know. Is that in, in the video? I don't video? know. I don't remember. I just... But that's crazy, right? <laughs> she put her own... <laughs> why is Mary in the Tyler Perry it? is going on? <laughs> <laughs> what in the Tyler Perry... <laughs> What in the Tyler Perry, girl? You are and not did you notice looked. how, I don't know if it was lighting or a filter, but did you notice how much lighter she looked? Let me tell you, Clay, it was so funny. Somebody tweeted, I think Stacey Dash just wanted to debut her new skin tone. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> that? That sunken place is dangerous. I know, girl, bye. <laughs> I mean, did she, you just found out that DMX how? died? A year and a half. I mean, he died in April of what, 2021? Is that accurate? And then you jump on social media. And I, all due respect, I never understand why anybody records videos of themselves crying. Yeah. I just, I, I never wouldn't. really, I'm, too vain I'm just that. not that person. Mm -mm. But Stacey Dash, wow. I just, what a shit what show. What a career. What a shit show. That's what it is. A train She's wreck. Careless. Clueless, C clueless, boom. That's the only explanation because, well, maybe if she watched BET instead of being so anti-supposedly segregation, she would have found out about the three funerals that they had on BET. And it was, it was jumping. They had the choir, they had performances, they had almost fight on stage. It was everything you could ask for from a black funeral. So maybe she should watch a little bit more BET and she would be more in the know. Stacey Dash. Wow. That just it's just fascinating to me. That sunken place is dangerous. It will remove yeah. you from culture. It well, will remove you. Congratulations to her. She said she was six years sober. So that's beautiful. Absolutely. Congratulations to her on that. That's good for her. We want to celebrate sobriety. But you sobriety didn't is bring beautiful. now. Why is DMX in it though? Why what? is DMX in it? You could and have Mary J. Blige. If she added the Mary J. Blige beat <laughs> in the background. You could have announced your new skin tone and your six years and left DMX out of it because he has no parts of he is resting in peace. Okay. <laughs> Come on, Stacey, get it together. But maybe this is her. Maybe she's trying to get back in with the black people. Like, oh, okay, you know, like I'm so late. Y'all don't blame me. Like, but now I care about black things. Like, I don't know what the girl's anger was, but it worked because we're talking about it, right? I mean, she went viral. So I guess all, she went viral. all press is good press. But no, you know, but she's one of those people when Stacey goes viral, it's not a good look. It's not. It's never for anything. Like I told you, she was early with the grift. Yeah. She really was a trailblazer. Yeah. Like, you know, before you didn't really see, you know, actors and, and you know, failed actresses. She really failed reality stars. She paved the way. I paved yeah. the way. I mean, Stacey really 
paved the way is for. Is she gonna be in your book? <laughs> she actually is in my book. Okay. The Grift. I can't wait to. The Black see Republican that. from the party of Lincoln to the party of Trump. Yeah, she because I kind of go in chronological order, and okay. it is. I mean, she was the first to do it, and it's and it's funny. I mean. I mean, Omarosa did it so much better. I mean, Omarosa oh, yeah. was Stacey Dash 2.0. She did it so much better, right? I mean, she actually smart. got a job in the White House. Omarosa is smarter. She went to, I believe, three HBCUs, but just did it so much better and got a New York Times bestselling book out of it. If Stacey would have stayed on that train a little bit longer, she could have been an anti-vaxxer. Uh, she could have, <laughs> you know, got a, a position and maybe as, as an assistant position in Ben Carson's HUD. I mean, something. <laughs> right. Yeah, bless her heart though. We gon' we gon' bless pray her for heart. Her. We gon' pray. But for, her. for real, sobriety, beautiful thing. I know beautiful. she has children. Yeah. I hope her her kids are okay. Uh, yeah, Stacy Dash. And but didn't you, you say you met her and she wasn't the nicest person? I did, and I, you know, because I was a big fan of hers at the time. I was at a party in Hollywood, and I was like, we oh, all can were. I get a picture? And she was like. Thank, but she took the picture and I didn't look cute. So I was like, well, that picture ain't going nowhere. Delete. <laughs> but I was just like, Ugh, like, what is her problem? So yeah, I'm not a fan, not a fan of hers. Well, Stacy, Miss Stacy Dash, I hope you're doing all right. I hope it was just a filter, you know. Sometimes those filters are very change, light. They mm -hmm. sometimes in the lighting, but you know, change, if it's not changing your skin tone can be very dangerous. So mm -hmm. prayers up for you, Stacy. So I want to say, I just double checked this. And I went to Stacey Dash's Instagram page. I've never in my life been there before. <laughs> and yes, the video where she's crying about DMX, finding out that he passed away nearly a year and a half ago, the Mary J. Blige song is in that video. Okay. So she posted the video <laughs> with the Mary J. Blige song behind her. She did that and posted it. Mary is like, now why am I in it? Why am I in it? Why am I in it? But Stacy is an evangelical. She should have posted uh, maybe the the Paula Paula White uh, Angels from Africa remix in the background. Yeah. Uh, she she could have posted uh, I don't know some Patty Austin. Remember Patty Austin? I don't Isn't know. I don't know why like that. So I don't know. But Amy I, but Grant how is Mary. She could have posted Amy Grant in the background. Why? Okay. Why is Mary in it? Why is Mary in? Like I said, she's auditioning for Tyler Perry Chan. That's the only explanation I can think of. You know, Tyler's very sympathetic to people. He will uplift a, a, a Black woman like nobody else will. So, you know, maybe that's what she was going for. That's no shame Forgive to Tyler. Me. Okay. Patty Austin isn't a, um, a evangelical singer. It's Patty something. A Christian singer. Why do they call... Why do they call white religious singers Christian singers, but black religious singers gospel singers? I, I never noticed Who that. started that? I don't know who started who that? that? Patty something. I remember this. She's a Christian singer. Is it a Patty? Sandy Patty. Sandy, Sandy Patty. Sandy Patty. Oh, I wouldn't have guessed that if you had a gun to my head. I would have no idea. <laughs> I know the Clark sisters, okay? <laughs> Patty LaBelle. Twicky. That's the best. Twicky Clark. Exactly. I love Twicky. Uh, my apologies to Patty Austin. I had you can I had the name mixed up, but it was Sandy Patty, Christian Sandy. musical singer. Yeah, so she should have had some Sandy Patty in the background. Stacy Dash, come no. on now. But she did put that music in the back. Maybe that was her producing skills. It was Stacey so Dash. it's giving scripted. It's giving very much <laughs> scripted because I'm sorry, but I love me some Mary J. Blige, but I oh, don't yeah, of have course. Mary J. Blige in the background when I'm crying and making a video for TikTok. I don't do that. Okay. <laughs>